ADP, home isolation workout, part of Strength Society. Today, push it. Action plan, let's get to work. Mm. Round one, let's get to work. What we're gonna start off with, into a pressing motion on the floor. We're gonna come up halfway and squeeze, back down to the floor. As soon as those elbows touch the floor, we're gonna drive back in. Try and do it aggressively as we can. Explode into it so we can get a nice contraction. Once we've done those, we're gonna drive all the way up into the middle, getting that full range motion up, making sure we keep those shoulder blades pressed into the shoulders come out of the movement and it goes right into the chest. Here we go, 20 in piece. And back, get into position, halfway, here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Slight pause at the bottom, all the way. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Squeeze that chest tight at the top. Nine, bringing those elbows into your midsection. 11, 12, come on. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, you know what to do, squeeze, and twist, and down. Fantastic, that's 20 a piece, we're gonna do that four times. Round one, let's get it done, on to round two. Round two, we're gonna do exactly the same thing, but we're gonna do it with fly motion. So starting off with that palms facing in, getting that nice bend in the arm, which we're gonna maintain all the way through. So as soon as the elbows start off the floor, we're gonna come halfway up and squeeze. Exactly the same as we did in the first one. Once we've done those reps, we're going to drive through to the middle, all the way up, getting that squeeze, tightening into the middle of your chest. Let's get it done. 15 a piece. And back. Get those elbows in. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six. Make sure we're squeezing. Eight, nine, ten, five, four, three, two, one, hold it, down, all the way up, 15, let's go, one, two, three, try and arc them out, four, five, it's going to help pull the strain, six, seven, eight, bring those elbows into the middle, nine, ten, imagine you were going to try and touch them, twelve, three, two, one more and hold, and down, fantastic. Round two complete, we're gonna do that four times, 15 a piece. Get it done, on to the next one. Round three, come on. So, round three, hope you're enjoying getting to lie down for most of it, it's gonna change. What we're gonna be doing is a bridge press. So, essentially, we're gonna drive them up as if we were doing a hip thruster. This is gonna mean that the movement goes into the lower chest. Drive in up for 20 presses. Once we've done those hips down, we're gonna rotate them into the palms and face it together, bring the elbows down to the side. Drive up through the middle. Don't press the weights together. We're gonna to save that for our tricep part, which is why I'll bring in and push them up. As soon as those elbows touch the floor, we're gonna fire it straight back in. Are we ready? Are you sitting comfortably? And so we shall begin. Get yourself back, pinch those shoulder blades together, hips up and drive. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine, ten, ten, nine, eight, seven, come on, six, five, get that strong contraction at the top, three, two, one, bring them down, turn the barrier, turn the angle of the dumbbell, keep those elbows tight to the body, and go, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, keep those shoulder blades pinched. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, hold, and down. Fantastic. Guess what? Four times. Get that work done, 20 a piece. Make sure we're hitting it into that bottom part. Drive the elbows into the middle of the work on the first one. What it's called is intention. So it's the attention of the elbows coming in. It's gonna bring that midline in on the chest. They're not going to touch. If they do, 
Don't see a duck to have foot. Do you understand? So, that round's done. On to the next one, round four, come on. Round four, what we're gonna be doing is body weight time, push-up time. We're gonna start off with normal push-ups, then we're gonna go into incline push-ups, then we're gonna raise our feet and do decline push-ups. So we attack three different areas of the chest. This is gonna burn. I'm gonna use these for my incline push-ups. Could go very wrong, I'm not recommending this. You have a platform, I haven't got anything to use. After this, I'm gonna raise my feet up onto this speaker to do those. We're gonna do 10 normal, 10 incline, 10 decline. Here we go. So, get those feet right down. Make sure those hands are below the chest. And go. One, two, make sure that chest goes right down by the floor. We don't wanna use our shoulders. We wanna avoid using our triceps as much as we can. Seven, eight, nine, 10. Straight into our incline push-ups. Oh, this is gonna be interesting. Let's move these back so I don't hit my head on the wall. And here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Excellent. Move that out of the way, get yourself ready for the decline. Don't try to get home. So, I'm going to raise my heels up. I'm going to hit a different part of the chest, like the bridge push up. And three, two, go. Ten, nine, eight, seven, now six, five, four, three, two, one. Right, right. Try and stay a little bit further away from the wall. So, four sets, ten of each, 30 reps per set. Get it done. Chest part complete. Come on. So, round five, tricep time. Put them up. What we're going to do, lay them back to give you a quick explanation. We're going to close the arm. Not coming like this, we want to close it so it takes the tension into it as much as we can. We're going to drive the dumbbells up as if you were wicking something. Squeeze the triceps at the top. Once we've done those, we're going to jump up and do close grip push ups. So, grab your weight. We're in for 20 of these. Get them up. Here we go. Pinch those shoulder blades together so we can take the shoulders up. And three, two, and go. One, two, three, four, five, six. Come on. Seven, eight, nine, ten, ten, nine, eight. Come on. Seven, six, five, four, three, Two, one more. Boom, pop those weights down. And pop yourself straight into close grip push-ups. So, the arms are gonna come in like this and stay tight to the body. 10 breaths. One, two, three, four. As you get to the top, push your elbows forward. Seven, eight, nine, hold. Magnificent, burn them up. Guess what? Four sets, get it done. Come on, one more to go. Final round, here we go. Left arm, 20. Right arm, 20. What I want you to do is start with your weaker arm. We're gonna use the weak point principle, try and tire out the weaker one first, with the most energy. For me, this is the one. We're gonna pop this dumbbell up, point your elbow off in this direction, try and keep the upper arm fully still, drive it up for the last five. We're gonna pause on the shoulder, and then drive up and make it a dead weight. Here we go. One, two, keep that core tight. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, come on, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Here we go. Pause, five, pause, four, pause, three, pause, two. Pause, one, excellent, and switch. Here we go, other arm, and go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, come on. Eight, bring it right down to the shoulder. Nine, 10, 11, come on. 12, keep these tight. 14, 15, here we go. Pause, five, pause, four, pause, three, Pause, two, pause, 
one. Fantastic. After that, we're going to go straight into dips. This is my tricky dip box. Get your feet right forward. Get those hands in a comfortable position. As tight as we can. And 15. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, five, four, three, two, hold. And down, magnificent, that's the last one done. Four sets, gonna do 20 on each arm on the singles, and we're gonna do 15 dips, four times. What I want you to really pay attention to, when you're doing the dips, don't do shrugs on them, make sure you're bending the arm, driving through, you've got a nice squeeze at the end. Mission complete. So, pushing done, all sections complete, magnificent. As you can probably see, it's not easy being in good shape, but it is worth it. Something you can carry with you, Especially through isolation, a lot of people are going mental, staying inside. Make fitness consume your life. Focus on your eating, make sure we're eating well. Keep your carbs to good carbs, trying to avoid the sugars. Keep your calories in the level that you need to. I'm going to do a video about calorie consumption. Um, and you need how to figure it out so you don't have to pay someone ridiculous money for a simple equation. Just get it going. Make sure you do anything. Have something to work on every day. I'm going to give you five sessions a week, the other two, I'll give you some other stuff to do. As always, kettlebell hell. You did it, like and subscribe, follow Andy underscore dance underscore physique on Instagram. Show me some love, keep it going, push it complete. Mm.